I've always admired the um, sectioned machinery which uh, you see in museums and like places. Um, so I decided to uh, make a couple of my own from uh, Steam Toys. Uh, I actually made two. There's, this one here is uh, the engine sub-assembly from a Walesco D16 and this one is uh, a Mamard SE3. The Mamard SE3 is in some ways a bit more interesting because it's uh, has a complete it's a complete engine including the boiler and all its fittings um, slightly less interesting in that it's only a, um, an oscillating cylinder type engine and therefore much simpler in its working. But it's still surprising how many people don't know how an oscillating cylinder engine works. So it does serve a purpose. I section the two cylinders in two different ways. The front one, the, uh, the cylinder itself is sectioned. In the other one, I've sectioned the port face so that you can see the how the, the two ports work. I've also sectioned the boiler. along with the fittings, the uh, whistle, safety valve and the throttle valve are all sectioned. And they all work as well. The uh, whistle still works, not as a whistle obviously, but the uh, safety valve plunger still works and throttle valve lever still works. And again, if we Turn flywheel. We can see the operation of the piston and the oscillating cylinder. In this case, you can see the felt pad oiling system. You can see the hole in the end of the cylinder from inside and at this end of the stroke you can see the upper hole in the port face. And the other one you can actually see both holes. The, the operation is it's interesting because you don't see much but you can see the configuration of the portholes and the pipes going to them and also the back end of the felt oiling system, felt pad. I also sectioned the burner so you can see what's inside a vaporising burner. This one also has a Meccano sprocket. If 
for powering from an external source although I've never tried this one with any external power source at all yet I might rig this one up along with the Willesco one at some time with uh, an electric motor on a stand for display purposes at some time in the future but that's a long distance project. 